What do you think of the Sarkeesian hire then? It's interesting. I'll tell you a great Al Davis story. So Sarkeesian was on our staff with the Raiders when North Turner was the head coach. After one year, went back to SC. Al was, when Al fired, Archell was looking for a coach. So he wasn't a real fan of Sarkeesian when he was on the staff, but for some reason he became a fan of Sarkeesian. Brought Sarkeesian up for an interview, was thinking about making him the head coach. Brought him back again, was thinking about making him a head coach. Brought him back the third time and told him, bring your offensive coordinator. I want to interview your offensive coordinator mm -hmm. who you think could be the head coach. He brings Lane Kiffin with him. So the two of them sit in the room with Al and they go over what they're going to do. They go back to Los Angeles. Sarkeesian leaks it out that he's not interested in the Raider job. He pulls out. So Al reads that on the ticker going through and says, well, you know what? I think Lane Kiffin was a better, was a better guy than him anyway. Brings Lane back for the interview and hires Lane. And then <laughs> that's a true story. Wow. That's, like, that is, is not even disputable. That's a completely true story. Lane Kiffin just happened to be just all along for the ride. So wait a minute. You're saying Lane Kiffin fell up? He fell Get up. out of here. He fell up. <laughs> You've got to be. He was in for the You've interview. You've got to be kidding he me. Was play, he was in for the interview as the wow. offensive coordinator, and all of a sudden he got a battlefield promotion. Now, I mean, U.S. Grant didn't have this. And I'm, I'm just blowing up our rundown, man, with all your great stories. <laughs> so you said you got another Lane Kiffin one? Yeah. Uh, this, okay, is a, this is a great one. So Lane Kiffin's the head coach of the Raiders. He's not ha happy with Al and the way things are going. This is before the, this is before the overhead. And so the Arkansas job opens up. Now, Arkansas, his father had coached at Arkansas. Lane's dad, Monty, was a coach at Arkansas. Sure. That's where all the, the, the Pete Carroll, that's where the mafia kind of started back in Arkansas. And Arkansas opens up, and Lane wants the Arkansas job. Well, Arkansas has two choices. It's either Bobby Petrino, who's now the head coach of the Atlanta Falcons, mm. or it's Lane Kiffin of the Raiders. And they tell Petrino, look, you can have this job, but you have to leave the Falcons today or else we're going to hire Lane Kiffin. And Petrino's like, okay. And that's why Petrino left midway through the season. Oh, that's why he amazing. just hightailed out of there. Because if not, Lane was going to get the job and be the head coach of the uh, Raiders, a, a head coach of the Arkansas Razorbacks. And Lane would have actually really wanted that job. In fact, I know reliably reported to me uh, that when that was announced that, that uh, he got the job, that Petrino got the job, Lane was slamming doors in the facility because he really thought he had that job. The Rich Eisen Show, weekdays at noon Eastern on Audience.